Hi, welcome back to my channel, which is Girl Boss Building Her Empire. And in this video, we're gonna do 10 winter fragrances for, for winter, right? But before we get started, can you go ahead on and do me a favor and hit the subscribe? Here's something fun. Uh, we're gonna do my top right button, hit the like button, and turn around and drop me a comment. What is your favorite winter fragrance? The one that you absolutely grab for all winter around, all winter? long right and also do me another favor can you go ahead on and hit that notification bell so every time i upload a video you'll be notified but one more thing right can you go over and follow me over on tiktok girl boss building her empire we're doing some good things there i'm doing my scent of the days i'm turning around and um doing motivational you know little sayings and different things like that it's a whole vibe and i'm also uploading some con well some content over there as well i don't want to be too repetitive right so this is a smile channel i'm growing over there with my followings and my likes and stuff so come on over here and show you girls some love but since you stopped by thank you so much so in this video what i'm gonna do is and um i'm gonna do my top 10 not too much you know harping on the notes but there are two fragrances that um I am gonna use up in the well the creams in enough the month of November, right? So I have that on my radar. These were some past collections that I turned around and I should have turned around and just got more of, but I only got the cream. So I don't want the cream to absolutely go bad. See how yellow it is? So I want to kind of use that. So I did do my little marking, but like I said, this is on my note, my December tray. So this is Sleigh Ride and Snuggles. And this has notes of Sun Kit, I'm sorry, Snow Kiss Icicles, Fluffy Blossom and Vanilla Bourbon. Y'all, I really can't see because of these um, things. So that is this right here. So this right here is on my December tray for my project Use It Up. I've been kind of dabbling. I have a few little combinations that I'm going to turn around and work with. I'm going to give y'all some combinations on this right here. So this might be my next video. Um, because I do like that vanilla bourbon. And I am going to try to really focus on, you know, kind of using it. It is loosen up good, y'all. This is, this is really good. Next is Christmas Cookies. So this has notes of creamy cookie dough, almond pescado, and caramel woods. Y'all, this is good. This right here is going to be in my project use it up for my following week. So we're we going to see how we rocking, right? So I know this is good. This is a, a, com I mean a, a set that didn't come back, but I kind of want to use it because, once again, you see how yellow that is? Yeah, so I'm going to kind of use this before it absolutely go bad. But this is caramel. This is so good. This is almost in the mind of Christmas cookies. No lie. You can turn around and wear that with a vanilla perfume and you would not be able to go wrong. So that's eight. I'm sorry. So this is number eight, which is um, snowflakes and cashmere, right? This has notes of... Vanilla Caramel Cream, Caramel Woods, and Frosty Clementine. This is good. This came back with the Strawberry and Snowflakes. And I really like this. I just don't, I just don't reach for it much. But this is, but this actually can be a springtime fragrance if you ever think about it. Not just, you know, winter. So, I like this. I keep this in my collection because you never know what I can actually pair it with. So... That's number eight. Here is number seven, and this is Jolly Gingerbread, right? So this has notes of golden gingerbread, vanilla icicles, and timber, yuletide timber. I don't know what that smell like, but this was more of the, not caramel, right? Not the caramel, um, gingerbread or the vanilla gingerbread like a cookie but this was more of i guess it's the timber right um i have a little bottle of gingerbread um and i'm gonna try to leak that in the card right i got that for walmart for no more than twenty dollars 
we was really excited because Bath and Body Works, it's been a long time, which I have never um, ran across a gingerbread, you know, set. But I don't know. So I have to play with this just a little more to see where we're coming from. Is it Grimond? Not exactly. Can it be? It just depends on how you lay it. So that is my number seven. Number six is winter candy apple right and this is red apples but i'm sorry winter rose petals crushed oranges maple leaf and fresh cinnamon so i also have the lotion right and i have been playing around with some of the uh victoria's secret apple you know fragrances or whatever and i'm gonna do my little comparison with that but this right here is a classic this is a staple right this is one that bath and body works bring back every single year so i see why this is number six you know and it's high up because i have been dabbling with some of the other you know apple notes so i want to kind of see you know where that kind of means me lands me but right now that's landing me in the number six position so down to my number five right and y'all will never believe drop a comment down below which i think my number one y'all never believe but anyway my number five is jolly i'm sorry golden berry mistletoe this is new this is sparkling berries sugar spruce and fresh air y'all this is berries this right here is berries no lie berries the the thing i like the most about it is that i can turn around and actually wear this with maybe um burberry hair right i can wear this with i can almost wear that with the impression of tom ford lost cherry but this is berry they have i have a ralph um lauren perfume and I'm going to try to link that right here. Um, that is very, you know, infused with berries, y'all. So, this right here is my number five. I have not, and I have a lotion. I have not even had a chance to kind of dabble in it a little bit. But I did like the berry note when it came to this different um, fragrance mist. So, I'm utterly excited about this. Next, which we're not, I'm not going to harp on it too much. This is Twisted Peppermint, right? This has notes of cool peppermint, sugared snow, vanilla, buttercream, and fresh balsam. This is, this makes everybody list. I didn't have about two or three of these, so this is high up because of the simple fact that it's Twisted Peppermint. You can rock this with a vanilla. There's so many ways that you can wet it, so my daughter loves the candle. So number three, is bright Christmas morning. So I had this in a candle once before. I really didn't particularly care for it. It utterly surprised me on the body care and it has notes of ripe, ripe red berries, blood orange and crisp apple. This is on my December tray, um, my weekly December tray. For the simple fact that this apple note that I have been vibing with for the last couple of uh, weeks, just trying to be, you know, those apple notes. So I can't kind of get inside of the vanilla. I'm keeping some vanilla, but I'm kind of getting tired of vanilla. But this right here is is really really good. So this is number three. Number two is yes, you guessed it. This is Vanilla B. Novel. <laughs> so this has notes of fresh vanilla bean, warm caramel, sugar cookies, whipped cream, and snow kiss must. Y'all, y'all should have known that I was going to rock a vanilla. What? Y'all know. If y'all don't know anything about me, I am a vanilla junkie. I love anything caramel and caramel and vanilla. I love it. So this right here, this is good. 
so this is coming in to my number two spot i didn't get the one from last year which the last one from last year was a little wonky wonky right but i did manage to get the lotion as well so i cannot wait to use this um to put this on my tray my weekly tray and we gonna see what it do so number one y'all this right here i was actually waiting for them to re-release this and they did not because i don't have a cream so i really don't want to turn around and just use her up so i've been using her sparingly because just maybe just maybe we might get a cream or just maybe SOS come on SAS come around and we turn around and get another they probably put some out on the table but this is my number one spot this is ice sugar plum y'all this is good this is sparkling sugar plum snowdrop petals and whoop marshmallow <sighs> y'all I smell the marshmallows in this. This is so good. Sometimes I just pair this with a just plain vanilla, just a plain vanilla lotion and a plain vanilla or vanilla 28. And this is good. So this right here is my number one ice sugar plum bath and body works. Please bring this back. Bring it back to us. We miss her. We was waiting because she was actually in, um, I think she was, no, she was actually in this collection right here. So please bring her back. But anyway, y'all, that's my number one. I love doing these. Well, I'm going to start de doing these countdowns. So comment down below which, one, which winter fragrance is your absolute number one that you, you go to pretty much and also comment down below what y'all think about this ice uh sugar plum i think she good if y'all did not get your hands on this then maybe when it come back around i just make a video let y'all know to go run and get it because this is good this marshmallow is good it kind of put me in the mind of that um um marshmallow fireside but the marshmallow fire slide is a little smoky. But this right here, you can smell this marshmallow. This is real good. So, like I said, y'all, please hit the subscribe button. Please hit the like button. Follow me over on TikTok. Girl Boss Building Her Empire. Comment down below and let me know what's your favorite, favorite winner. Um, perfume. or It doesn't have to be this from Bath & Body Works. It could be from... Victoria's Secret, if it can be from Fenty, it can be from, you know, any place. Just comment down below. Let's talk in the comments on what's your favorite uh, body care item or favorite winter fragrance, right? So, as always, a form of looking good is a form of smelling good. Thank you and you be blessed.